Welcome back to CES 2023. And welcome to Inside Android. Between brand partnerships and product design updates, Android is all about devices working better together. So we're gonna sit down and have a chat with some leaders from Google. And we are here with Samir Samad. He's the VP of product management here at Google. So my favorite thing about this Google activation is that we're seeing this in real time. I can see my watch connect with my Pixel phone. What would you say your favorite example is of devices working better together here at CES? Okay, I think this is a small thing, but it's just a pet peeve of mine when I can't get really cool like headphones that I bought to work with my phone. And you know, Bluetooth is wonderful, but also not wonderful sometimes. And with FastPair, we now have 300 plus headphone brands and, and models that all work seamlessly. So it just makes it really simple, and I love that. I'm here with Dieter Bone, the Director of Product Operations here at Google. What example of a multi-device experience are you most excited to showcase here at CES? I think that I am most excited about this new thing that we're doing with Spotify. Okay, so, I love music, I'm very interested. <laughs> so Android has this, uh, this music player that shows up in the lock screen or the notifications, and it's got this little output switcher. Mm -hmm. And you tap it, and you can choose between the headphones or speakers. But this year, we're going to allow you to also choose between Spotify Connect sources. So it's going to be really cool. I am here with Shalini Global Pie. She is the GM and VP of Google TV. What would you say your favorite example is of Android devices and Google devices working better together here at CES? I, I don't know if you're like me, but I constantly lose my remote control. I'm like, where is it? And it's usually under the sofa somewhere. The dog's eating it. The dog! <laughs> <laughs> but today, we have launched a new feature where on the Google TV mobile phone, you can find what you're looking for, you can cast it very quickly with one click, and you can also control the remote through your app. So the remote control is now on the phone, very easily controllable, no more finding, what did the dog eat today? Ooh, yeah. And so I'm very excited about that. What do you think the future is like for devices working better together? So that is part of what Android's ethos is all about, is working together with partners and making all that come together. You might search for something on your phone, you might lean back and watch the video on your TV, you may be doing something else on your tablet. So we want to make sure that those journeys are very smooth for our users. It sounds really corny to say like we put the user first, but it really is true. And when you're trying to create a new technology, thinking through what would actually be most useful to a human being who's walked into their house and has got 25 gadgets in there uh, to get them to talk to each other is really important. Talking about all of this cool tech, I'm also curious about something more personal. Sure. Firing Minds would like to know, uh -huh. what is your favorite device pairing at Casa Dieter? So I don't want to brag. Okay. But I have a uh, Sony OLED TV. Uh, uh, it's very nice. <laughs> um, and it, so it runs Google TV and I can use my phone as a remote for it. It's a lot more convenient than like hunting down the remote because my phone is, let's be honest, in my hand all of the time. Well, it sounds like we're doing movie night at Dieter's. Yeah, sounds amazing. So my nephew is getting married soon. Being from India, we're all Bollywood fans. We're all going to do a Bollywood dance and we're exchanging steps and videos over WhatsApp. So that's my favorite use case, is really taking my Android phone, using my WhatsApp app to launch the video onto the TV and then all of us dancing to Bollywood. Well, I'm a little biased because, you know, I'm a Googler. <laughs> and I have a Google Assistant routine and I say it's movie time and the screen lights up, the Google TV comes on, uh, and the lights go down and all that kind of happens together. The kids love it. In fact, they love it so much that when they're doing their homework, they may just be like, hey, it's Google, movie time. it's movie time. I would do the same thing. We'd like to give a big thanks to Shalini, Dieter, and Samir for answering some questions with us to get everyone a little bit closer to what's going on inside Android. And guys, we've had so much fun covering CES 2023 in Vegas. Thank you so much for tuning in, but we got a blast. Got to bounce. See you later. Bye.